pleased to respond to the Minister's uh, comments regarding National Disability Employment Awareness Month on behalf of the Progressive Conservative Caucus and our leader, Patrick Brown. I don't really want to talk about the statistics because, frankly, the statistics are still poor. Uh, what I'd like to talk about are some successes. Um, I uh, was involved and attended a community living Dufferin um, special event. And the special event was essentially an annual event that uh, Community Living Dufferin hosts to thank their employers for um, hiring individuals who have uh, different abilities. And they, as part of that evening, they include a, a best employee, best in the class award ceremony. And I will never forget when Adam was given his uh, outstanding employee award medal. And Adam, instead of coming up to the front and saying thank you and accepting his award, Adam actually gave what was essentially an elevator pitch. And the elevator pitch was why you should hire me because I have a special ability. Just because I'm different, I have a special and unique ability that will make a difference. So if you know anyone who is willing to hire me, Adam, then please do that. Speaker, that was many, many years ago, but I was, I was absolutely in, impressed and frankly, uh, everybody gave Adam a standing ovation because we thought right on, this is exactly what we need to be doing more of. We need more employees who are willing to step up, who are willing to take a risk, which really isn't very much of a risk, frankly, um, and we need more ambassadors like Adam. I also remember during the uh, Select Committee on Developmental Services uh, being part of that committee when we heard from Mark Wafer. Many of you will know who Mark Wafer is. He was a uh, franchise owner of multiple Tim Hortons for many, many years. <laughs> and, uh, and he's hired over 100 individuals who have a different ability. And he is a huge ambassador. He actually participates in a program called Rotary at Work. And essentially what Mark and Rotary at Work does is they go out and they educate employers. And they talk to employers about why it makes good business sense to hire people with different abilities. And Mark has been doing that for years. I'm pleased to see that he's going to continue that advocacy. And even when he sold his uh, Tim Hortons franchises, he ensured through the sale that his long-term employees who have uh, disabilities were going to continue to be part of those organizations. We need more people like Adam. We need more people like Mark Wafer. We could do more as MPPs, but I, I think today, as we mark DEEM, Disabilities uh, Awareness Employment Month, Disabilities Employment Awareness Month, that we remember there are some great, positive, proactive examples out there across Ontario, and we need to encourage our employers, and we, as employers, need to understand that there are many, many opportunities that we can provide, that we can talk about, and ensure that there are more people like Adam who, instead of just doing the elevator pitch, actually get the job. Thanks, Speaker.